what's up everybody it's cjk here it's been a minute since the last time you saw me was it's been like three weeks since the last time I posted a video i know it's been too long and in today's video as you can tell off the title of this video yeah i really do want to talk about it because it's very important as if you guys know that i wanted to take a one message and just say thank you guys so much for all you guys' concern and what i've been going through and you know you guys saw it all you saw my dms and i just wasn't doing well i just wasn't mentally doing great so if you guys know what i was going through happy you guys do not know what i was going through uh gonna kind of basically tell you guys the story so let's get right into it so basically this past week saturday so it's been almost a week ago um currently today is friday august 9th and it's a friday at 10 6 p.m eastern time when i'm filming this video and this week last week I, yeah it was saturday i don't even remember the date guys don't even ask but anyways um last week saturday basically i got my hair dye and uh i did at that time i did and you know i was like Yay, I was getting my hair dyed, but then I knew my dad was getting sick. I was getting a little <laughs> tiny bit nervous, but I was like, eh, it'll be okay because I might not get sick ever, and I might not ever get COVID ever. I have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. But So that's what I was thinking in my mind. And then my mom was like, yeah, your dad's sick. You might expose it. You don't know and blah, blah, blah. But I was trying to take it precaution and careful. I didn't give him a hug or a kiss because he was sick. But then well, I got to see him and then I say goodbye and you know, blah, blah, blah. And you know, same with my mom. And like, she brought me back to like college place and where I live and stuff like that. That's what I did. And then Sunday I was feeling fine. Obviously I was talking to my friend CD Flock and that was good. That was a great time. And then Monday I woke up and I was like, what is going on with my throat? And I was like, something's not right. So I felt like something was wrong with my throat and it felt like it was dry. Like, it didn't have enough moisture in it. Like, it felt dry. Like, every time I'm, like, swell, and I was like, okay, this doesn't seem right. So I don't know what was happening. I don't know what was going on through my mind. Like, I hope I'm not getting sick. I hope I didn't get what my dad gets, and blah, blah, blah. So then, I was, like, calling my mom in the morning. I was like, hey, mom, I think my throat is, so, like, dry. I don't know if I'm getting sick or blah, blah, blah. My mom's like thinking that you might be getting sick and i was like no i don't know i was like i don't know i don't remember exact words but my mom was like you should probably drink some water or she said like dehydration i don't know i was hydrated we i don't know if i was that or i my mom could have been wrong i don't know so my mom was like dehydration she texted me about it i was i, I didn't get it it was either that or i don't know it, it's been a minute then after that i was fine like, I was fine. I was just hanging out, playing video games, and then about three or four hours later, I started feeling bad again. Feeling good, I was starting to feel awful. I was starting to feel achy, shaky, chills coming in. My eyes were shutting down. I was starting to feel tired and not feeling great, and I started getting a little headache. I was like, hope I'm not getting sick. Then I started calling my mom, and I was like, hey, mom, I don't feel good. And then my mom was like, we might have to take you like a COVID test. So I took a COVID test and this was literally on Monday. And it was like more like Monday Eve. And um, I took a COVID test and I took it. So then we waited for like 15 minutes. And after that, then, cause this is when my mom was there. And after I like took the COVID test, I was negative and I was fine. So my mom's like, you're all set to go and you can just relax and do whatever. We'll cancel work and blah, blah, blah and get you rest and get better soon. So I did that. And then the next day I woke up, I was like feeling stuffy and I just didn't feel good. It's just like, I felt okay. But then I was like, okay, then I'll just kind of just eat my breakfast and what I normally do and everything. And then, you know what? I just started feeling kind of ooh, later, later on, like way later. It was like evening it was like morning i was fine later on i was feeling <laughs> basically after that basically oh no i was feeling chilly awful i started laying in my bed i was like i am not feeling good i was just resting and just nope took a nap and like uh -uh, i couldn't take a nap i was just nope so then i started calling my mom i was like hey mom i'm not feeling good and i was like telling her like i need to take a covid test because i was like not doing well and so she was like, yeah, let's take it. Because I couldn't take it at the time I took that Monday. It was this past Monday. I couldn't take it. And so I basically had to wait till Wednesday 
well. I was like, I was being impatient. I was just concerned. And I feel like I was getting sick. I don't know what it was and blah, blah, blah. I was just like, I want to take it now. I want to find out if I have COVID or not. So I took the test. And then I kind of just started looking at the line. I was like, oh, no. It was like shifting off. And then eventually I kind of started noticing that it was one line. But then like, I think it was like, before 15 minutes was up, I could start seeing, like, the line just starting to show up. And I was like, oh, shoot. Don't tell me I have COVID. So then I checked, and I was like, yep, I certainly have COVID. So then, unfortunately, I had to be sent home. I couldn't be at my college, at the house. I had to be sent home because I had COVID. It was, unfortunately, horrible. I had to go through. My throat was just dropping in pain. I had to drink some soup. I just, oh my God. And then I just started feeling, ugh, and my stomach wasn't feeling good. Just everything was just a mess up. And then after that, then, you know, I had to go to bed. And then the next day, nope, I was feeling awful. Just pff, completely felt crap. And then after that, I started like feeling blah. <laughs> and then Thursday was the worst. I started feeling, oh my God, my stomach wasn't feeling good. I started feeling like I was going to throw up. And, you know, I just, I had to go to the bathroom. I don't know what was going on. I started crying and it just was not doing well. I wasn't mentally doing great. So then I just like, I need to rest and I need to get better. So that's what I did. So I took a rest and got better. And then the next thing I knew, I started feeling better. And then after that, I felt great. I felt great again. So then I felt fine, but then I still had to go to bed. And my head was just kind of pounding. Like I said, I was crying because, you know, when you cry, you get a headache. I was fine, and I just went to bed, and normally, just fine. The next day I woke up, I was like, <laughs> Wow. I felt kind of depressed. I don't know why. It's probably because of my tiredness, and I just kept falling asleep. And then I woke up, I was like, <laughs> What just happened? My sickness is going away. My throat is getting better. Everything is just healing. I was like, Okay, it was a weird experience. I've never had COVID, like, the second time. Like, I had it the first time, but, like, the second time was a lot more serious. And because I didn't, well, I got my vaccination, but it wasn't that close at the time. When I had the COVID in 2021, it was literally close because we already had it. It was already that close, and so it felt kind of weird, but... As of right now, I am doing so much better. I'm mentally better. And I've still got some stomach issues and stuff like that. But other than that, I am mentally better. So thank you guys so much for all you guys' concern. I mean, you know, I was dying. It was not good. You guys probably got a lot of messages. I didn't want to mention that I was like, oh, I'm dying and blah, blah, blah. But uh, you know what? I just wanted to just say and come on here and just be like, Hey, this is what I was going through. It felt like COVID was dying, but I wasn't really dying. So I was just acting I was dying. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I just wanted to let you guys know that what I've been going through. I hope you guys to see you guys all in the next video. I'm not too sure what to post. But yeah, stay tuned and love you guys all. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.